Goku meets his third child with Vados, the Saiyan Supreme Angel. Goku's third son, Gon, is born, with Vados, the angelic Saiyan, appears. Goku had a child with Vados in another timeline. Vados discovers the whole truth. Planet Champa, Universe 6. Champa watched the training that Goku had been having with Vados after the High Priest had declared that the next celestial war was about to occur. All the Saiyans continued to carry out their training and all the other universes that had the strongest warriors were getting ready to show their true powers. While the great enemy was about to attack. So far we know, Zyko from Universe 16 who was next to the Angel Zyros from Universe 15 and also the evil Saiyan and Ziel, the one who defeated Beerus and Whis. There are other beings that we don't know yet. A great battle is about to take place, but meanwhile in Universe 6, Goku was carrying out his training. Goku is shocked to learn that in another timeline, there was a relationship between Vados and Goku. At that moment, a great explosion starts. Goku says, I cannot understand. At what point could I have had a relationship or have met the lady in another timeline? Vado says, Son Goku, I think I'll tell you everything that happened. Because for this celestial war, we'll need Gon's help. Know that your third son's name with me is Gon the Heavenly Saiyan. Alright partner, why don't you whack that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any videos and stay connected to our entire universe of Z Warriors. Let's get back to the point. Vados begins to explain Gon's birth. Timeline 14 This was the timeline in which Goku was killed by heart disease. After all of the Dragon Balls were destroyed following the deaths of Piccolo and Kamisama, Goku had no way of returning to Earth. He just saw all the destruction the androids ended up creating. Right after a lot of catastrophe has happened, we can see that the universe was erased by Zenosama. But still, the other world continued to exist. Goku was dead performing his training with the Kaio Lord. Unlike anything we had ever known, the God of Destruction and the Angel of Universe 7 no longer existed due to the great catastrophe that had happened and as Beerus had been killed in that universe, Whis was left wandering. Goku trained alongside King Kai and had already become the most powerful Saiyan in all of Universe 7 in that timeline. Until the moment that events other than those that happened in the current timeline begin to occur. Champa appears on King Kai's planet and blames all mortals for not being able to protect Earth from the threats that happened and because of that, his brother was dead. Champa blames Goku for the death of the Supreme Kai that caused Beerus' death. Goku says, I don't know who you are, but you are threatening the very existence of us all. I'm here to protect this planet. After all, as everyone here has died once, if one more death happens, everyone will cease to exist. I will ask you to leave here. Champa watches and speaks. I don't care about you. I am a god of destruction from Universe 6 and I can erase your entire existence now. That will be the end of you. Goku activates his Super Saiyan transformation and starts fighting Champa. Goku says, It doesn't matter to me if you're some kind of god of destruction or whoever you are. I won't let you break up with anyone. Vados, the angel of Universe 6, starts looking at Goku and smiles, saying, This guy has a lot of grit and is very handsome. I see that he really manages to get more and more powerful and he fears no one. I'm in love with him. This is amazing. Vados looks at Goku and speaks. You want to get stronger, don't you? You like to be able to raise your powers more and more, right? Since you want so much to become more powerful, know that I can train you. But for that, you'll have to surpass Lord Champa in at least one aspect in battle. Goku notices Vardosa's kindness and says, You mean you're as strong as this guy? I really want to train. I want to become more powerful. Champa says, Vardos, how do you say that? I'm trying to end this guy's existence because he let Beerus die and you want to train him? Vados begins to smile and speaks. 
Well, Mr. Champa, you don't need to care so much about that. He just died before all this happened. Champa gets angry and says, Be quiet, Vados. I'll solve this situation. Champa goes on top of Goku and starts throwing several blows at Goku. Goku says, What is it? Even with this guy's muscle mass, he's totally unlike any other being I've faced. This power is extremely higher than everyone else. At that moment, Lord Kai says, Goku, this guy is a god of destruction. You have no power that can compare with his. Stop this. It doesn't make any sense. Quit this fight soon. Goku receives several blows from Champa until his body is completely on the ground. Champa says, I had already warned that all this would end here. In a few moments, a great Saiyan aura is passed to Goku. It seems that all the powers of the Saiyans ended up being transported to Goku. At that moment, Goku says, I don't know who you think I am, but I've seen all my friends die and I couldn't do anything, not even be brought back to Earth. The Dragon Balls are no more. I'm tired of losing my loved ones. I won't let you break up with anyone. Goku manages to activate the mastery of self-movement without even having trained with any angels. Vados is fascinated and says, Like this? It looks like a time paradox. This guy managed to use the technique that even the gods of destruction have a hard time performing. At that moment, Vados begins to smile. Champa says, This is impossible. How did this guy manage to do that? When Champa goes to attack Goku, Goku dodges and flings Champa away from Kai's planet. At the moment, Champa gets angry and says he will kill Goku. Champa lunges at Goku. Goku looks serious, but Champa is thrown away by Vados. Vados says, Enough, Mr. Champa. This fight is over. Now I will deal with Goku. At that moment, we can see that Goku started to smile and says, Does that mean I'm going to train with you? What is your name? Vados introduces himself to Goku. As time passes in Universe 6, Goku and Vados continue their training but with a totally different feel. Goku's looks and Vado's looks were totally different. It seems that Goku was very lonely for just carrying out his training and felt a forbidden feeling for the Angel of Universe 6. The Angel of Universe 6 also had this same thought. It was a mistake for a mortal and an angel to relate, but it ended up happening. As time passed, Goku was already considered one of the most powerful beings in all the universes. Even though he had been killed, he had ended up being resurrected by Universe 6's own angel. Angels have the power to resurrect other mortals without even using the Dragon Balls. Goku managed to come back to life, but this time as a celestial being. From the love between Vados and Goku, a fruit emerged. Gon is the third son of Goku, the half Saiyan and the half angel hybrid, the being that possessed the power to end and destroy anyone. At that moment in this timeline number 14, everything was going peacefully until a big explosion and gods of destruction from other universes started to invade the universe. Due to the great power that was raised from Goku, Vados and Gon, everything was changing Gon was still a child who already possessed the mastery of self-movement. Back to the current moments. Goku is fascinated by everything he hears about his third son. Goku says, Does that mean he was much more powerful? Maybe he was a stronger hybrid even than Gohan himself. But what happened in his timeline? Vados takes out his staff and on his staff is shown a great vision of the angels of the universes that were erased by Zenosama and managed to appear in this other timeline. Probably someone fulfilled that wish and after doing that, they wanted to steal the body of Gon as a receptacle. It was at that moment that Vados told Goku from the other timeline that he needed to escape. Even though we were powerful, it was practically impossible to fight six angels together. 
Of these angels, one of them was Zyros that you met a little while ago. The others have not yet appeared here in our current timeline, but they are certainly involved in this celestial war. Long after that, I had the dream and could get the message of myself from another timeline, in which Gon would be the key piece to fight this war, so I needed to talk to Son Goku. Gon is here with me. I present to you your third child. Goku is shocked by what he sees. Gon was with the current Vados. Vados says, Now you will need to enter a training in the time room of Universe 6. For Gon to get older and more powerful so he can awaken his full strength. Because the real battle, as the High Priest announced, is about to begin. Goku smiles and says, Does that mean this boy has my blood? So now we will get stronger together. Let's start. To be continued. Gone, Goku's third son is introduced. The new battle is about to begin. So my partner, what do you believe and what do you imagine about all of this? Regardless of what it is, it's more than important that you share your thoughts in the comments so that we can get into a crazy debate. Whack that like button and subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any videos. That's all there is to it. I will see you in the next one. Goodbye.